All right, I'm going to tie an F fly, and I've got a size 14 hook in the vise, and the thread that I'm going to use is an 8 dot, and it's a light olive. So I'll just get that started about the midway point in the hook shank, and bring it down to about the point in the hook there. The body that I'm going to use, probably most commonly, is a pheasant tail, like an olive pheasant tail, but I'm going to use for this a turkey, um, and I'm going to remove maybe a quarter inch section off the stem and I'm going to tie this in tip first so it has kind of that natural taper and the, and the tip here is a more supple material to tie in so I'll take it in by the tip and I'll wrap it down uh, to just the bend in the hook and then I'll advance my thread up to about the three quarter mark or so and then I can just start to wind this wind this forward and because it's a, a good width it'll cover pretty quickly as long as you keep it opened up. It's going to want to twist together so I'm just untwisting it kind of as I go here so it doesn't clump together. And then when I get to the eye I can just tie that off Alright, now the wing is going to be a CDC, and typically when I work with CD, I really like to use the puffs, just because I think they're easy to, easy to work with. Uh, but for this fly, I'm going to use the ones that come on the, on the stem. So I'm going to measure this out like you would kind of an elk hair caddis to go to uh, the back, all the way to the, to the bend in the hook or the back of the hook. And I'm just going to set it right on top, and then I'll take a, a wrap to secure and make sure that it sits just how I want it to and then I'll take a couple of turns underneath and then I can trim all of that off and then I'll just hold this up and I'll finish making out the head just covering in those spots that were left by the CDC all right, and then I can whip finish this. And then I can trim my excess thread. And then I will finish this fly with uh, some head cement just to make sure everything gets locked down, but just a word of caution. Less is more in, in this case because what you don't want to do is uh, get any on that, that CDC. So just take a little, little drop just to make sure everything gets bound in together. And that's it. Uh, can work well as an uh, emerger pattern. Uh, I'd tie it up or fish it a lot. Uh, has a trailing pattern and, and does real well. You can tie it in a variety of colors, but uh, the olive seems to work the best. It's kind of a, a blue wing olive imitation emerger, etc. So that is the F fly.